Hi everyone. So today I'm going to try, well I'm going to be doing, dyeing some fabric. Hold on, can you actually see me? Yeah, you can see me, that's better. Um, so I'm going to be dyeing some fabric today. Um, some organic bamboo velour. But I'm going to be trying a different technique that I don't think anybody's actually done before. Or I haven't seen anyone do it yet. Um, and basically what I'm going to be using. So my... Um, fabric's already been soaking for about 20 minutes-ish in some sewed rash. Hold on, let me just move away. Oh look, you can see me now, that's a bit better. Um, so I've already been soaking my fabric in sewed rash. So I'm going to just loosely wring that out and then bob it in here which basically all it is is just a plastic container with a grill items that you've used for dyeing don't then reuse it for food or whatever so that is now just this is just for my dyeing now so i'm going to attempt to do like splats with the dye on here so i'm gonna wring that out and i'm gonna put it on there and then i'll show you what's happening in there. So two minutes. Right, so. <laughs> so you want to try and well for like better effect effects like scrunch it up a little. Contatina and scrunching. Now on this griddle pan thing, it has still got some dye pigments on it. So as you can see, as I'm putting it on there, there's little colours coming on onto the fabric already, which I don't mind because obviously I'm not doing the set colours or patterns or anything. I'm just gonna see what effect I get. Um, it might not even work. I do not know yet. Um, but we shall see. So in a minute I shall show you. So I'll just show you what I've got now. So as you can see I've scrunched up all the fabric into like a little square and then I'm just going to like flick the colours on to the fabric and see how that goes. So I'm going to start flicking and then I'll show you what happened so I'll be back with two. So I'm just gonna I've just done orange so this is what it looks like with just orange. Hold on let me see if you can can I turn the camera around? No okay. Right so that's what it's looking like with just orange on at the minute as you can see it's just splattered and obviously there's a the big splodges are like what's come off the toothbrush. So I'll do the rest of the colours and then I will um, like come back again so there we so I'm back so what I've done is I have now hung it on my line for the simple fact it seemed to be running but I kind of like the way it's running down the fabric so I'm going to try because it's really windy I'm going to try and show you what it so This is it at the minute, how it looks. So, obviously, I will try my best to upload a video and let you see what it looks like once I, well, upload or add it on to the end of this video, what it looks like. But I have no idea how to edit. I'm rubbish at stuff like this. But it won't be till tomorrow because I need to let it kind of set in now. So uh, I'll see how it goes. Bye.